Welcome to the installation instructions for the Rubbermaid AutoClean Dispenser Unit. The Rubbermaid AutoClean Dispenser is easily installed and delivers powerful formulas that are always working against bacteria and malodors to ensure a great restroom experience. The first step to installation is to inventory and identify the AutoClean Dispenser package parts and items. The AutoClean Dispenser package includes the AutoClean Dispenser, foam mounting pad, alcohol pad for wall cleaning, open-in wrench, cabinet key, two screws and two anchors, 12 one inch stainless tube, retro elbow for side mount, and you will need two D batteries. Based on the urinal pipe size, AutoClean connection kits are available in 3 quarter, 1 and 1 quarter, and 1 and 1 half inch sizes. The AutoClean drill through saddle connection kit comes with front and back saddle, black gasket, drill guide, two saddle bolts, hole plug seal, Allen wrench, delivery tube, and drill bit. After locating all parts and components and disengaging a Rubbermaid Auto Flush unit, you're ready to install the AutoClean dispenser. Take the backing paper on the foam mounting pad and peel back one side only. Place the backing paper into position on the back of the AutoClean dispenser. Insert the long side of the stainless tube into the AutoClean dispenser making sure to insert the end completely into the fitting and hand tighten the compression nut. Position the AutoClean dispenser two and one half inches above the flush valve. This prevents the dispenser cover from hitting the flush valve cap. Place the back half of the saddle around the pipe two and one half inches from the vacuum tube mark. Then line up the holes with the back half of the saddle and attach with the Allen wrench. Angle the saddle at 45 degrees and do not tighten all the way. Take the tube and line up with the back hole in the saddle kit. Slide all in and tighten the nut with the wrench. For both top and side mount, clean the wall area with the alcohol pad, then dry completely with a dry cloth. Then turn the saddle kit to 90 degrees, remove the paper backing from the foam pad and press the dispenser against the wall two and one half inches above the flush valve cap and press for one minute. If desired, you may use screws and anchors to drill and mount the AutoClean dispenser unit into a wall. Once the dispenser is firmly mounted, securely tighten the two tube compression nuts with the Allen wrench, then tighten the two saddle bolts. Insert the drill bit into the drill chuck, then tighten the drill chuck. Insert the drill bit into the drill bit guide on the saddle and drill through both sides of the sparge pump to the mark on the bit. Remember to drill only after the dispenser, tube, and saddle are securely mounted. Clean out the drilling pathway by repeating the drill motion back and forth a few times. Check the holes for any loose material. Insert the rubber delivery tube into the skinny side of the saddle clamp and feed all the way down the sparge pipe flush valve. Install the plug seal where the drill bit guide was removed using the Allen wrench. Make sure the O-ring is on seal. Insert and firmly tighten with provided Allen wrench. The AutoClean dispenser is now installed and ready for programming. To access the inside of the dispenser, insert the cabinet key, then push the key down while pulling the cover forward and down. Load the two D alkaline batteries in the battery slots. Rotate the actuator with its hole facing outwards. Insert the pump tip into the actuator opening. Press firmly into the actuator to set the seal. Hold the enter button down. Push on off six times to prime the refill bottle. Leave the dispenser on after priming and shut the cover. The front of the AutoClean LED light will show yellow when dispenser is operating and red when refill is empty. Press the Refill Reset button for two full seconds to reset the AutoClean dispenser. The AutoClean dispenser has settings available via the switchboard located to the side of the Purinel cleaner and deodorizer bottle. You can set an audio tone to signal it's time for a refill or battery charge. The dispenser comes preset to a normal setting. Depending on your conditions, you can set the dispenser for normal, heavy, or light usage, which will affect the length of the refill use. 
You may also set the dispenser to operate 24 hours a day, or day or night only. Once you've programmed your AutoClean, close the cover and the unit is fully operational. After installing and programming the AutoClean dispenser, it is always working for a higher level of clean. The Rubbermaid AutoClean Dispenser, another innovative hygiene solution from Rubbermaid Commercial Products.